So I'm going to show you how to use wire parameter to control different objects. So I have this morpher and volume select, which the object is interacting with the plane, and I want to create a controller to control my objects. So firstly, I create a box, and I use wire parameter to link them together. So right click and select wire parameters. In transform, I choose position, position X, connect to this object one, transform position X. Then you'll see this parameter wiring where it shows box and the object. So I want to create a one-way connection, click connect. So now they are connected in the X position. If I move my box as the controller, these objects is moving together with me. And then I'm going to create another controller for the second object. Let's copy this. I click wire parameters, transform position X, link to the second object, transform position X. And I'm creating a one-way connection. But now I want this object moving in a different direction, moving left. So I put a negative. Let's connect, update. So if I move this box to the right, my object is moving to the left. So if I move these two box together, I'm controlling two objects in different directions. Wire parameter not only used to transform in moving, it also works in many other directions or other functions that we can explore. So now I'm going to create a third controller to control the two objects in the Y direction, which they will move in a vertical direction. But this time, instead of transform it in position, I'm, tra I'm transforming the rotation Z. And control the first object, transform, position, Y. One-way connection, connect. And at the same controller, I'm repeating the wire parameters. This time to the second object, transform, position, Y. In a one-way connection, but this one I give it a negative so that it moves in a different direction. So if I rotate this box right now, the two objects is moving in a different direction. Now I have three different controllers. These two is controlling the movement of the objects in a X direction. And this rotation controller is controlling the vertical direction of the two objects. Now I can start creating the Animation auto key. So now I'm moving the controller to control the X direction. So this controller is moving the two objects together now. And if I add the third controller into the animation, which is a rotation controller. And I mix them together. Now they will move in a diagonal direction because the three controllers are working together. Which two is moving in X direction, another one is moving Y direction, which resulted in a diagonal moving direction of two objects. So that's the basic of wire parameters. Thank you.